Ben Toron and Dungannon United Youth under 13s met at Crumlin on a cold winter's morning. Ben Toron in the green and Dungannon in the yellow. It was a grand that started brightly and attacked down the right hand side with Reese Little winning an early corner. Ben Toran won an early free kick and this teasing delivery by Brendan Hamilton allowed Jay Harvey to get on the end of it but he could only prod wide of the right post. In the early stages it was all Grand Torn pressure and this powerful run down the left wing forced a cannon goalkeeper Marcinia Martins into a clearance kick. With the game scoreless at the break, into the second half we go, and Van Torn started it brightly with a decent run down the left wing by Jude Johnson, however he just ran the ball out of play at the wrong time. Then came the opening goal in the game, and it was Dungannon that scored it against the run of play, when this flowing move found the feet of Sam Anderson, who fired powerfully into the roof of the net. 1-0 to Dungannon. Then Torin responded almost immediately when Jude Johnson found himself unmarked inside the area and volleyed home to make the score one each. The next goal was always going to be key and after patient build-up play Glenn Torren went ahead when Jude Johnson scored at the back post from a Reese Walsh ball into the box that Marcinia Martins couldn't quite handle. 2-1 to Glenn Torren now. Dungannon forced a corner down at the other end, but good alert goalkeeping from Ryan Kerr made sure Dungannon didn't have a sniff on this occasion. With time ticking away, Glenn Torren hunted for another goal, however this Brendan Hamilton ball into the box proved a simple save for Martins in the Dungannon goal. Strong running from Glentoran's number 9, Reese Little, resulted in another shot, however his shot flashed just wide of the left post. The Glens almost bundled in a late third, however Martins got back on her goal line to keep the deficit to just a single goal. This deflected pass from Killian McCandless allowed the ball to present itself to two goal hero Jude Johnson who almost added to his scoring tally however his final shot of the morning was straight into the hands of the Dungannon goalkeeper. With time running out Dungannon tried to respond in the dying stages of the game. But at full time it finished Grand Torn 2, Dungannon United Youth 1. Very delighted. Uh, super performance from the boys today. We asked them at the start in the changing room to go out and show that how good they are. Um, I thought they were absolutely fantastic. Dungannon came and got in amongst it, but I thought we were I thought we were the stronger team on the day. Um, took our two goals well. Jude Johnson was super up there. Um, all in all, brilliant performance, really pleased for the boys, so roll on the next one. Yeah, it was, uh, but this group of boys, their heads never drop, even if they're 1-0 down, so they picked themselves up and went again. Um, once we got it back to one each, I thought we were going to push on and get the winner, so superb, absolutely fantastic performance, all of that part. Um, I, did, I think we didn't play the way we can, we didn't keep the ball well enough, um, and then when obviously when you went one up, you're thinking you're going to kick on from there, but. 
they, they responded with a ball in the box, great ball in the box and a good finish. Ah, it was a good a good strike. The we Sam Anderson has got a good strike on him and he, um, he, he scored well. After that we, we stopped playing and let them back in the game too easy. We they replayed shortly after their first goal and obviously they seen the game out. I can take a lot of pause from today. Um, obviously games like this you got to get to know your players. Um, who's who is ready for the challenge, who's up for the fight as such. Um, and maybe Glen Torn won the midfield battle today, which and midfield midfield battle wins games.